This is Kip Forrest, and in this video we'll talk about the guitar in the Viking series. During the creation of guitar, the main emphasis was made on the maximum simplicity, punchy and fat guitar sound. Even if you've never spent a lot of time on recording and reamping the guitar, you can easily write excellent riffs for your compositions. At the moment, the Vikings library includes three types of guitars, metal, crunch and overdriven guitar. It means one guitar with three kinds of reamping. This rhythm guitar has four types of technique. Long palm mute, short palm mute, sustain and harmony. Let's listen to some riffs that I made for this video. Great, now let's have a look at the instrument's main menu. The first and the most important is the parameter setting control, in which you can enable or disable the animation. Beside of that, there are two ways for activating the sound production, key switch and velocity volume. I'm closer to the second option because I'm creating my riffs in the piano roll. Here's the stop velocity function, which automatically mutes the last played note. The left panel includes the main parameters, attack, sustain and release. If your goal is to achieve a well-adjusted rhythm guitar sound, then we recommend using the default setting. However, you can use them if you want to achieve any special sound. The stereo parameter is responsible for expanding and narrowing the stereo. The double parameter is responsible for playing the samples in right and left channels. At the minimum value, all samples will be played in mono. It may seem ridiculous, but the vibrato parameter will add a vibrato effect to the currently playing note. The lag is responsible for the time lag between left and right channel. The legato activates the artificial glide script. We set it for a long time to make the sound as realistic as possible. As for me, the best legato setting is 250 milliseconds, which is indicated in the default settings. Let's listen to these two riffs using this parameter. Beside the main window, the instrument also has a riff maker, a modulation window, a preset window which you can choose from or mix with your own sound, and an FX rack including EQs, filters, compressors and other tools for further sound processing. Separately, I want to note that you can use your old cabinets for any of the three types of guitars. You can try them in the FX rack or use plugins from other companies. More detailed information about the operation of these models you will see in other upcoming videos. I think you have noticed that I have used additional backing scenes layers from the library. I suggest you listen to part of the riff and then move to the project with the rendered tracks of other instruments to see what happened. <laughs> Sounds is perfect. Oh, it's really cool. Come on, me gusta este sonido. Joder, como mola. Oh, me gusta este sonido. Tien guitarra igual. Que guitarras de puta madre. Anda, vamos, vamos.
don't hesitate and place order at a special pre-order price. By pre-ordering the Vikings library now, the Vikings guitar expansion will be included to the library for free. When the pre-order period ends, the Viking guitars expansion will be sold separately. Thank you for watching. Follow us for the upcoming videos about the Vikings library. See you next time. Keep forest.